Sawyer's and Griffin's three month update. Okay, let's get into it. So firstly, their personalities are amazing. We are so blessed. They are easygoing babies. They don't really fuss at all. They are just great spirits. They are happy. I mean, he, Sawyer, laughs all the time. I mean, all the time he giggles and laughs. Not right now, because he wants me to pick him up. Sawyer is a little bit more fussy than Griffin, but not by much. He just likes to be held. He likes to be comforted and loved, and he likes to be talked to and looked at, and he likes to wiggle. He's very strong in his legs, as you can see. And his brother is noticing him. And we just, this literally this last week, I started noticing each other. They look at each other. They'll kind of like reach out for each other. Um, it's been really neat to see them actually recognize, you know, themselves like their brother like the guy been kicking them and like prodding at them <laughs> for like the last like 10 12 months huh especially in the womb huh which one was kicking who who was kicking who their personalities are amazing they are in length 23 and a half inches long both of them like we are both exactly the same we're just shocked by that their weight is almost exact Sawyer is 13 pounds and Griffin is 13 and a half pounds which we still thought Sawyer is more of a, like a thicker baby, like he holds his weight in the tummy and his cheeks, if you can tell. So um, I think Sawyer's weight is kind of more just like distributed like throughout. So when you pick up Griffin, he just feels more stockier in the middle. So we were surprised by his weight. We thought he'd be like a pound or two more than Sawyer, but no, no. They're almost the same. Haha. <laughs> yeah. They both are still on formula. Um, Griffin is still on homemade formula. Um, he is doing really well. They do five bottles a day. They sleep through the night, which is amazing. When they hit about the 10-week 10, 10 mark, they started sleeping through the night. I don't know how the heck this happened. We are so blessed, but they are sleeping, and we are sleeping, and I'm living. I'm getting through it. It's been such a blessing. I, I just, I don't know. They're just easy babies overall. I mean, I know things change, but right now we are just so, like, just surprised. We really, loved, we really thought that sleeping wasn't going to happen for a long time. We really thought that they would be really, you know, in the beginning with Griffin, you know, with his collarbone, he was so upset. He cried all the time. We really thought that we'd never get out of, like, that kind of, like, feeling. Um, that kind of, like, days where they're crying and not sleeping and would never end. But it's here. It's ended. We are getting through, like, we're actually enjoying our Christmas, but I didn't think we'd actually get to enjoy this year because, you know, babies are hard work, huh? But you guys are easier than the toddlers, huh? You're easier than Harrison and Wynn, huh? Yes, you are. Yes, you are. They're in one diapers right now. We are um, I'm gonna change them into two diapers at the end of the month because they're starting to do some blowouts, and that's not good for us. Who likes blowouts? Nobody. Nobody. Both are teething. They both are on amber teething necklaces. I just did a video a few days ago on my channel, and um, I'll leave a link in the description box below and explaining on how amazing amber teething necklaces are because they are just amazing. They just make him, make the babies less fussy, less cryy, and it's easier, huh? Do you see your brother? Do you see your brother? You want to sit? Say hi? No? Griffin's still having kind of a rough time latching. Getting better. Not perfect. He doesn't lose so much liquid anymore. But he does, he kind of, instead of sucking, he kind of bites the nipple. Um, he really can't get a... A real like a latch uh, and we're just doctors say that it'll work its way out we're just you know we've kind of gotten used to it he's gotten used to it and he's you know he's gaining weight so we're really not worried about it we'll see what happens when he gets older if there's still a problem maybe we'll have to go to a mouth specialist I don't know but he definitely has a problem latching still but I mean he's not worse for the wear it's way better than it was so we're not really complaining we're just yeah he's, he's getting through it huh you're getting through it <laughs> Yeah. They both have kind of like a mousy, like, blonde hair still. Sawyer's is just coming in a little bit still. Uh, they both still have like a little bit of cradle cap on the back, which is normal. The doctor said to just leave it alone. It'll work its way out. Oh, big yawn. Big yawn. Yes, 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 yes. Griffin's hair is still kind of wavy curly, which is super cute. We still kind of get that faux hawk look about them, which is <laughs> so cute. They are grabbing and reaching for things, smiling and laughing all the time. They love their kick mats. We have them in these cool chairs that we just got. They are awesome because you can sit them up and they want to sit up. They want to look around. They want to see their siblings. And these chairs, I mean, if we didn't buy them, I don't know what we'd be doing. We'd be holding them all the time because uh, they just want to be, they want to look around. They want to sit up and do things. You can see him. He's, he's ready for a bouncer. He's ready to stand up and walk away, huh? I try to dress them alike, but as you can see, someone spits up. 
someone has a blowout and I can't dress them like I want to. They do spit up still quite a lot, uh, especially Griffin. About every feeding is a pretty big spit up after a big burp, which is no fun. And drooling from from the teething. So we do change their outfits quite a lot. So we don't really swaddle anymore. We kind of just swaddle their bottom half. We let their arms free because we found that if they're confined, they're just they kind of like they stretch out of it and they kind of get upset. So we leave their arms now open when they sleep. Uh, they both are on binkies. Not not they're not on all the time. We only just to get them to sleep. Like we'll put a binky in, they'll pass out. Uh, or if they're really upset, and we have to, like we're making a bottle and they've got to wait. We put a binky in and they're fine. We still use the swings every now and then. What else? We do a little bit of tummy time, not a lot. It's really hard because we still have, you know, Harrison to win. If he's three, he turns two next month. You know, they just want to be in with the babies. They want to be right there, and it gets a little scary because they want to get right in the mats with them. So we don't do a ton of tummy time, but that will get more in the future, especially when they start getting ready to crawl, huh? Start practicing more. So their eye color is still blue. Some people think that Griffin's eyes could turn brown. I'm still on the skeptic side of that because the centers are so white. Because I know when Harrison's were, was this little, his centers were really white and his eyes stayed blue. So we'll see. I definitely think Sawyer's are still going to stay blue. They've been on a couple outings. They went to the mall twice. They were really good. They've done so good. Uh, they, I can't say it enough. These babies are so good. We are so blessed because we didn't expect this. We thought this would be, you know, unbelievably hard. And we're not saying it's not easy. This is really hard work. We thought it'd be like where we miss our old lives and we would, you know, we would be just like kind of horrid, like make time go by faster so we can get to, you know, a good time, good place in our life. But no, it's actually really good and we're really enjoying it. We're just seeing them grow and look around and the changing and it's been, re I'm just so blessed that they are sleeping. I know that if they weren't sleeping, this video would be a very different video. <laughs> this video would be like, oh no, I feel like I'm dying. I can't sleep. But no, it's, it's not that video. It is just, just great. It's just a great, great video. So yeah, that's the video of the twin boys, Griffin and Sawyer. They are doing awesome. And I'll do a four month update. I'll probably do an update every month until they're one, just to let you guys know how they're doing. But they are great. We are so blessed, huh? Mm -hmm. Yes. All right, so we're gonna end the video now. Thanks guys for watching. Please like and subscribe. Thumb this video up for us. We would super, super appreciate it. We want you guys to have a wonderful day. Bye. Say bye, guys. Bye. Bye. <laughs>